Oh bado kitu. Uh, bado. Wasulizie kwanza. Uh, wasulizie. I know you have new music. I know you have a new song and and we'll get to that uh, a mm. little bit later on. Okay. Uh but one thing about you is that you've you've been in this music business for a very long time when I yelled vizuri you've seen it transform into what it is today. Mm. And and not a lot of artists get to do that get to stay there for years and years yeah. and years na bado unatoa ngoma na watu wana kufeel you're still consistent yes yeah thank you what what has been the secret for you you know staying consistent and and you know i just speak? love this job i love what i'm doing mm. and i have passion for it yeah uh, that's what keeps me going all right yeah in the 10 years you've been in the industry that <laughs> kitu gani kikubwa ambacho unaweza sema kwamba umejifunza katika miaka kumi ambayo umekuepo kwenye ama zaidi ya miaka ambayo umekuepo kwenye industry nimejifunza changamoto uh-huh. jinsi ya kukabiliana nazo uh-huh. na kuweza kuzishinda uh-huh. na nimejifunza kutoka na watu wengine wapi ambao wanakuja uh-huh. na kila kitu ambacho kinatokea kila siku ni vitu vipya uh-huh. hakuna kitu ambacho kinakuwa kile kile kila siku kwa kila siku ni siku ya kujifunza uh-huh. alright uh-huh. How do you deal with um, people being in your in your personal life in your business these days on social media mm. you know blogs are very quick to write about about they really want to know what's going on in in your personal life how do you deal with that part of the job It's not easy but unfortunately I have to deal with it yeah. you have to ca- uh, cancel yourself mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you have to be ready Yeah. yeah. Are you still dating? It's a bad thing. This your personal life is just for a minute. Yes, I am. I you am dating. Yeah. Right? Okay. Mimi nitakurudisha nyuma kidogo RC na na samani JD. Um najua kwamba wewe ni mwanadada ambao umeshuhudia vitu vingi sana, especially tukizungumza kuhusiana na mambo ya mahusiano. Kwanza unamkumbuka your first love? Yeah. Unamkumbuka? Unamkumbuka. Um Kitu gani ambacho kilipelekea labda mkaja mkaachana? <laughs> na kwa nini amko pamoja sasa hivi? Ni zamani ah. mapenzi ya kitoto yalikuwa. Mm-hmm. Na Na ya, ya, alikuwa na mambo mengi. Uh-huh. Yeah, unajua wanamme huwa na mambo mengi tu. Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 Eti. Eti na wewe tuna mambo mengi. I also Wuna. read I, I read somewhere that you made a, a, a comment about relationships no kasema not all relationships necessarily have to lead to marriage yeah. as mm-hmm. in what what did you mean by that what were you it's like whenever you start to date someone everyone is expecting you to get to marry that person they don't know if you're ready or not that's you, your pressure to yeah mm-hmm. so they should understand that you need time You don't just jump into marriage. It's not easy. Yeah. Take yeah. your time, people. Take That's your good time. advice. Right. <laughs> kitu kimoja, kitu kimoja ambacho uh, ni kizuri ni kwamba um, hivi karibuni umeonesha kwamba ume umekuwa mtu ambao uko focus zaidi kwenye muziki na hata katika maisha yako binafsi. Uliwahi pia ku invest katika eh, biashara mbalimbali. Um, labda tuzungumze kuhusu na investments ambazo uliwahi kuzifanya binafsi kama JD. Ya yeah, investment zilikuwepo lakini biashara inapokuwa haiendi vizuri hauwezi kuingangania kwa sababu itaendelea kukutia hasara. Inabidi urudi nyuma kwanza. Usimame ujipange, uangalie ni namna gani unaweza kuanza upya tena na biashara ya namna gani. Okay. Lakini mimi binafsi ni mfanya biashara na nitafanya biashara nyingi zaidi hapo mbele. Muziki pia ni biashara. Mm-hmm. Na kuna wakati unaweza jaribu ukafeli. Vitu gani ambavyo unaweza kusema kwamba ulijaribu labda ukafeli maybe in the uh, in the past especially about management when it comes to music. Uh, kwa bahati nzuri ni sema sijawahi kuwa na management kwa muda mrefu sana. Management ile ya serious kabisa. Kwa hivyo nilikuwa nafanya kazi tu na marafiki na ndugu na jamaa. Kwa hivyo kuhusu kufeli kwenye swala la management. Aha laba hii management mpya ambayo nimeanza kufanya nayo kazi sasa hivi ndio naweza nikatoa majibu baadaye yeah. are you still working with uh, Taurus Taurus music ndio yes i've just signed with Taurus okay. music okay all right so um mkataba wako na Taurus music labda una intel vitu gani na gani labda ah uh, mambo mazuri kufanya uh, tulichokubaliana ni kufanya kitu ambacho sijawahi kufanya huko nyuma aha okay mm-hmm. na kwenye muziki kila siku ni lazima ufanye kitu 
kingine kipya. Kwa hiyo mtu anapokuja na ofa ya ku, kuahidi kuwa kitu ambacho anaweza yeye kufanya na wewe ni tofauti na kile ulichokuwa unafanya nyuma. Huwezi uh-huh. kusita kujaribu. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Inasemekana kwamba ulisign deal ya mamilioni na Taurus Mills. Mo sign million. Hebu. Sasa msake kuniletea majamba. Hebu tuambie. Ni kweli kwamba umesign deal ya mamilioni na Taurus Mills? Tumesign deal nzuri. Naweza kusema hivyo. Kulikuwa na issue na album yako. Uliwahi kuizungumzia alafu baadaye nikawa mbo sijilisitishwa. Tuweze kusema na album yako. Album ipo imetoka Aha. na inapatikana kwenye platforms kama Boomplay Music mm-hmm. na Mkito. Ya, yeah, haijasitishwa. Album ya Woman iko. Ah, ipo ipo. Yeah. <laughs> Ime iko tangu match. Na mtu akitaka akitaka kuipata kama ulivyosikia ni kwamba unaweza kuipata kwenye Boomplay kama alivyosema na pia unaweza ukamfuatilia na kuweza kujua jinsi gani ambavyo unaweza ukai access. Having been in the industry uh, for for as long as you have and all the success you've had and you know there's a new crop of of young ladies trying to you know get into this business also what what would be your advice to 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 that person or or something you wish you knew when you were just starting out uh, first of all i would like to congratulate them because they are all doing well and they shouldn't give up i love what they're doing mm-hmm. yeah so just stay stay focused yeah stay focused work hard that's mm-hmm. it mm-hmm. Okay. Mimi ningependa kujua kabla hujaendelea msanii wa Kenya ambaye yani ukisikia ngoma yake yani unasema na huyu anafumua. Msanii wa Kenya ambaye ana yani ukisikia ngoma yake unasema ah huyu ana anakimbiza. Lakini ni wengi. Msanii mmoja tu. Nyanshinsky. Nyanshinsky. Kitu gani hasa kinakuvutia na Nyanshinsky? Um na nimependa mashairi uh-huh. ambayo anafanya yako deep uh-huh. na melodi zake ni tofauti uh-huh. na melodi zingine ambazo tumewahi kuzizoea okay so i mentioned your new song uh, that you're going to perform for us now <laughs> i hope <laughs> maybe you can t- tell us about uh, what the song is about and then we'll we'll make room for you to to perform it's it it's a love us. song it's just a simple love song i think for my baby that's it oh. yeah. So hii ngoma umemwimbia Spice Music au? Yeah. Ni kwa ajili yake. Spice. <laughs> Na mababi wote. <laughs> mababi wote. All bays around the world. Okay, we're going to make some room here for our Lady JD so she right can perform so. our new love song for the lovers in the house. <laughs> It's brand new. <laughs> And we'll make way for it here. DJ Crossfade, you ready? Mm-hmm. 